Hey guys, it's Jamesed Pie, and I am bringing you Oracle Combo. I, I don't know uh, if anybody else has seen a lot of this, but I just got beat by this on the ladder yesterday, and I'm going to do a video. So this is the best that I could come up with based off of what I think is in it. I don't know. Maybe maybe somebody's got a better deck list, but this is what I've got. It's, it's these cards. I'll put the deck in the thing below. So let's do the thing we'll play some games all right cool beans let's play some st standard ranked yeah let's try some oracle combo boo -doo -boo -boo -doo -boo. hope everybody's doing well today we're gonna we're gonna try this deck i don't think it's gonna work <laughs> i played uh one in the play queue and it worked and i i was just surprised so we'll We'll see how badly we get beat. All right, it's got cards. Let's keep it. I don't. I don't know. It's got lands and spells. Let's uh, let's make them think we're gonna mill them out. This is what happened to me actually. Is I I got hit with an overwhelming, uh, overwhelmed apprentice, and I thought, huh, this is some kind of blue mill deck. I am going to get milled to death, and then, and then they did not mill me. They instead did uh, blue things. So let's just get in. Again, we're going to we're gonna make them think that we're trying to kill them. We're not trying to kill them. We're just trying to win the game. So, it's all right. All right, my opponent's on some kind of blue-white thing here. Because we got to mill them. We got to learn a little bit about what they're doing. I wonder if they're going to counter Cura. They do. They counter it. Straight up Dovin's Veto. All right, you know. I mean, I guess these days, even the creature decks are running a lot of non-creature uh, spells, so you're pretty fine doing this. But it looks like we're going to run up against an Azorius Control. And this is actually probably the deck that I worried the most about, just simply because, uh, you know, what it's doing here. But let's go ahead and mill them again. I don't get to draw the card, but that's okay. I'm going to try to get Narset off the board, and then, you know, maybe we can draw some cards with Jace. Or force a removal spell on Jace, which then means that they can't absorb me uh, when I cast Gaddick. Gadwick. Gaddick Teague! He's not Gaddick Teague. Ooh, planar cleansing. All right, that's, I mean, that's neat. <clears throat> Alright, I only get this when he enters the battlefield, right? When when he enters the battlefield, draw X cards. Alright, cool. Okay, okay, okay. We'll cast uh three X Thyrax. Uh this is, a, this is a pretty okay card. I was I was not sure if I wanted to include him or not. I didn't see him in the one that my opponent had, but I did uh I did a little googly goo and I saw it on a on a list on deckstats.net, so it's all right. It is what it is. But we did pull the uh, the counter spell. They are one card away, or one land away from uh, from hitting this. Now, personally, I think I think I'm better off just drawing a bunch of cards. Where am I at? Six lands here. So let's just go ahead and try to draw six. I I don't know if they're going to be able to counter it or not, but. I'm guessing we're getting uh, Planar Cleansing, so. Ooh, nope. Notice the Lotus. And a Corridor Monitor. All right, well, ooh. Ooh, baby. There goes Jace. We knew, he, we knew it was time for him to go. But we might be going off. This might be it, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for next Lotus. Oops, can't cast that yet. <laughs> that would that would have been bad. <clears throat> Alright, and then we can Oracle? I don't have any card draw left though, right? Yeah, I think that's it for card draw. But we can set up for the for the planar cleansing. I think I may have played this wrong. Ooh. Yeah, I think I played it wrong because I, I need the uh, I need a card draw here. And I don't have it. But I'll get in for four. We'll uh we'll slowly tick down their life total. But 
please don't, please don't play a plains or a island or an untapped whatever. Ooh, baby. Okay, 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 okay. Didn't get planar cleansing there. All right. Hmm. It's too expensive. Oh, he did Dovin's Veto it. I mean, it was too expensive anyway, but... <clears throat> yeah, if he planar cleansings, he's going to lose the, the Jace anyway, so... Or the Teferi. <laughs> I always call this one Jace. I mean, he used to be... He used to he used to be the, the Planeswalker of, of note. Now he's just kind of the Planeswalker of jank. Oh, he got Exile. I was like, where'd my Jace go? And a Shatter, this guy. All right, he's probably going to Shatter. And that's fine. We'll just let him Shatter this guy here. Oh, the thing that sucks about that is that uh, I can't Cavalier of Gales here. I'm guessing this is gonna be a counter spell, so we're gonna we're gonna watch this happen. I think we're about done here. Yeah, we're gonna just be done with this one. I can't uh, I can't beat this Narset. I need to be able to draw cards. Oh, or, oh, oh well, we'll uh, we'll try it again. Come on, come on. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I think I messed that one up. This is like, that was the second time I ever played the, the deck. So, whatever. Uh, yeah. Feel free in the comments to tell me how much of an idiot I am. Because, yeah. Learning's fun. Alright, we gotta get up to four. We're on the play again, so that's cool. I didn't even put on cool sleeves. I should have put on cool sleeves. Uh-oh. Well, we're not going to have a lot of turns to get this done. He's got a big butt. I think... I think we're going to go with the butt here. Uh, We need the other land, so we're just going to take the land now. We'll worry about getting the Thassa's Oracle later. But this is probably Cavalcade. Would be my guess. I don't know why he didn't attack. Oh, because he wanted to get the... Okay, I see. I see what he's doing. Alright, next turn we'll be able to uh, Nyx Lotus. And then we're going to be able to make a punk ton of mana. Alright, I don't need Agent of Treachery. Uh, Jace? I don't think I need Jace right now either. It's probably wrong. I'm good at being wrong. <laughs> that's, that's what I know about this. Uh, again, this, this deck should be super intuitive, and it probably is. But that's okay. You know what? It's fine to be bad at magic. I'm bad at magic. You're probably bad at magic. You know how I know? Because you're probably a human being. Human beings are bad at magic. We all suck. It's okay, though. So, runaway steamkin to the face. We're not blocking that. No blocks. We're just gonna tap out for the Nyx Bloom. Or Nyx, Nyx Lotus? Nyx Bloom. <laughs> Nyx Bloom Agent is pretty sweet. That is a card that I have used just alongside the Nyx Lotus. And uh, it is also jank. It's super duper jank. And I love jank. Jank, 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 jank. Okay. So I don't really have a lot going on for this turn, other than maybe dying. I need... What do I need to be able to do something good here? I mean, Agent of Treachery is... I was going to say, I was going to count the mana here. I was going to count that at, at four, but this is going to be... It's only going to give me three. All right, now it's not going to give me anything. <laughs> okay. Well, this is the this is the downside of this deck. It doesn't look like Cavalcade, though. I just... It has Ginger Brute, which is a, a huge... Yeah, okay. This is definitely a Cavalcade deck. I don't understand Runaway Steamkins in Cavalcade decks. Um, they just feel bad. But 
I guess they work. I just it just doesn't feel right, you know. It's like one of those things where it's like it just doesn't trigger cavalcade, so and it doesn't trigger the the Spitfire if cavalcade's on the board. But they didn't even need cavalcade to beat this this janky janky combo. I mean, I'll show them that I got the corridor monitor. <laughs> Uh, try to hold control. Tap it. Resolve it. Tap it. <laughs> Look at that. I can't even cast it. Alright, well that's game. Okay, we'll try it again. Let's go again. Now if I were some other YouTubers... I would definitely just cut this and then we'd try it again. And then we'd try it again. And then we'd try it again. And this is why a lot of those guys have like 45 minute videos and they're all cut up and they release like one video a day. But it's like, how many hours a day did you spend doing that video? Three? Four? Five? You know? Um, I'm not saying that everybody does it. I'm just saying I. I suspect that some people are out there doing it. Stirring up some shit. That's what I'm doing. It's okay, though. But I don't I don't feel like doing that. I was a live streamer, so I, I'm just going to kind of do this like a live stream. And eventually, uh, maybe my YouTube videos will get better. But for now, we're just doing it like this. Alright, so we're going to Thassa's Oracle. It's going to give us uh, three looks on the top. Ooh, I need that Nyx Lotus. Alright, we're just going to take the Nyx Lotus. We're going to hope for another land. Uh, we'll attack him for one. Get in there. <laughs> That's not what this game is about, but we're going to get in there. I don't know why I was off on that tangent. I think I just need to talk. I think that's a big part of what I am supposed to be doing when I when I make this stuff. I don't know. I, I don't think that anybody's going to really be watching it. <laughs> I think that that's really where we're at is that... Uh, I'm trying to get back. I'm trying to trying to do the thing, but you know, uh, when this video hits uh, five views, I'll be happy, and then you know that'll be that. So maybe in the future, if I can keep these these videos going, then you know maybe I'll get more than that. Uh, a big issue that I have though is that my computer kind of crashes every now and again, which is uh, no buenos. Ooh, are they going to counter it? Is this blue-green flash? Please. Ugh. All right, well, I'm not... I'm not going to win this one. That That's just how this is going to go. Blue-green flash is one of those decks where it's just a pain. I wasn't paying enough attention. I just saw the green, and I, I, I saw him add this, and then I don't know. But yeah, this is blue-green flash, so there's not really a lot that I can do here. Um... Because they're gonna have a bunch of counter spells and whatever else, I I don't play best of one. Uh, just full disclosure, I don't play best of one. Uh, but anyway, I think the topic I was trying to say before I got distracted by the fact that I'm gonna lose this game is that um, my computer crashes sometimes just randomly. Uh, Euro crashes my computer. Uh, for instance, like if I try to escape Euro, a lot of times it'll just crash. Um, so it makes making content or streaming or whatever uh, fairly difficult. So it is what it is. But yeah, this deck is really frustrating to play against. I can't I can't do anything about it. Like it's um it's typically something like sixteen counter spells or whatever. So. Uh, it's like every everything that I try to do is going to be countered, and then they have a clock that's so fast that it doesn't matter that you could run them out of counter spells because uh, you know either they uh, nissa you out of the game, which is coming right now, um, or they uh, uh, what's the wolf? It's not wicked wolf. It's the other one. Uh, but they use the wolf, the flash wolf. I can't think of the name of it right now. Uh, that makes wolf tokens every turn, um, or whatever. So it, it just becomes this, like, really, really quick clock. And I don't have a, 
Um, I don't have what I need here. I need uh, a Nyx Bloom Lotus, so. I don't even think, want, like if it were on the top, it would matter. Yeah, that's okay. We're just gonna quit this one. All right, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep playing until I can get this thing to go off. <clears throat> I don't care about my rank. It's not a big deal. All I wanted to do was get to mythic this season, and I I got it today. So I'm gonna make YouTube videos today. We'll uh, we'll play through a few of these, and then you know. If you have any uh, suggestions, decks, or whatever that I could play, uh, go ahead and send them. I have a, a bunch of cards, so I am down if I have the cards for it. Alright, looks like another Cavalcade deck. Usually Cavalcades are running the Banneret. Um, I think there's some Mono Red builds that are running it as well, but... Ugh. Yeah, I need to get a 1-4 on the board. Um, next turn I can get Kiora down, which would be cool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, cool. Alright, so we'll get Kiora. We'll just leave her at 7, we'll pass the turn. I'm guessing Cavalcade's coming down this turn. Nope, just pumping that, that banner at. All at me. Embercleave? <clears throat> oh, double shock. Okay. Ooh, a barge in instead of a shock. All right, well, that gives him trample, right? Or does it not give him trample? Oh, he's a human. He doesn't get trample. Okay. All right, it's not cavalcade. It's probably just regular mono red. I did not draw a land. <laughs> okay. Well, that sucks. Because now I'm going to lose. That's how fast standard is. If you don't draw the land, you just kind of lose. So we're just going to concede this one. He's got 1, 2, 3, 4, uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 power on the board. I'm dead on board. Yeah, this deck is uh, not super great. Not great and ranked. <clears throat> Okie dokie. Wonder if I'll ever get it. Probably not. Okay. Well, this is fine. I'm just gonna try to Thassa's Oracle. That'll give me two looks at it. We'll see what we get. Uh, another blue black deck. Okay. Come on, combo. All right, Nick's Lotus is what we're gonna take here. Don't know if we're going to get that on the board or not, because, you know, I have no idea what they're actually playing here. Uh, I don't like them keeping that one. That's scary. All right, let's take a look at top four. Kiora. And then they're going to mill me. <laughs> That's probably what's going to happen. It'll be funny. Oh, well, we'll, uh, we'll keep it, keep it going. Ooh, it's a salty deck. Salty, salty, salty. All right, well, if they don't kill me. What? And they left? I won a game? What? Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, best of one, man. I don't, I don't know. I don't get it. They may have, uh. They may have been four colors or five colors and didn't grab their colors. They could have uh, been mana screwed. They, they may understand the combo. The wombo wombo ness of this combo. I just didn't want to deal with it. I don't know, man. I don't know. 
Uh, this is a bad hand. I shouldn't have kept this. I mean, I guess it's probably fine against uh, a cavalcade, but uh, looks like we're probably on a doom foretold. Ooh, that's his oracle. We're going to get that one out real quick. Uh, we'll take the cure right here. Now we're just looking for the next Bloom Lotus. Okay, okay, okay. Opponent takes the uncounterable thing. I'm guessing they're gonna kill this, but that's fine. We're just gonna get in for one. Now a land means that we can get Cavalier Gales out, which would be nice. I don't like them keeping up on top. That's bad for us. Birth of my lattice. What about my lattice? All right, land off the top. We get the, the tapa, a tapa, 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 a tapa, tapa, and boom. Ooh. Now part of me wants to hide the next lotus. Because, uh, reasons. But, the other part of me is going to hide the, uh, do I need the island or the cure more? Hmm. I don't think it matters because I can't really go off. I don't have anything to go off with. So we're going to get in. Um, my guess is they're going to kill the Cavalier of Gales, but they're probably not going to just, like, straight up murder, ride down, whatever. They're, yeah, Banishing Light. So then I don't get the draws off of it. So, here's the problem. Now I can make a near infinite amount of mana. But I don't have the draw. I don't, I don't have any of, like, the, the card draw stuff that I need, uh, to do that. So, I'm just going to pass the turn and hope for card draw. Uh, so we have like two, uh, two Gadwicks, um, three Finale of, of Revelation, um, four Thassa's Interventions. I think that's all. I think that's what we're drawing towards. Those are all of the cards that we're drawing towards right now. And I need any one of those and I can just like go off. Um, and that's assuming that he doesn't like just Dovin's Veto or whatever. Um, but a finale of Revelation would be super great. Especially if he goes like, um, uh, Elspeth Conquers Death, hits Kiora, and then I draw it off the top. That would be perfect. So we've set up the Elspeth Conquers Death. So we've got him tapped out. Can you hear the nervousness in my breath? Damn! <laughs> Just didn't hit it. Alright. Um, well, I'm going to go ahead and drop this Kiora. I'm going to try to scry two. Oh, it's on the top! <sighs> it's on the top. All right. Well, that could have lined up just a slight bit better. <laughs> oh, man. Tap out, opponent. And not Elspeth Conquer's death again. That would be bad. Actually, it doesn't really matter because he's already, he's already hit me for two here. Oh, man. Well, there goes the Cura. Hmm. <sighs> Oh, man. Just strips away the hand. I can't even... Oh. <sighs> All right. Well, let's go into control mode. Let's... Uh... I don't even have to go into control mode. I can just tap that. Drop the corridor monitor. Untap that. What does that leave me at? 10? Uh... So I can X equals 6 here. This isn't even good. This isn't even good. I'm drawing 6 cards and I'm... I've already lost this match. That's where we're at. <laughs> Oh, man, that sucks. All right, well. I'm 
Maybe I'll hit a card draw spell. Well, neither one of those are card draw spells. Uh, maybe I'll hit another card draw spell. That's kind of that's kind of where we're at. But he needs to tap out again. <laughs> I'm so dead. Is this like? Oh, he hasn't shown any like Dovin's vetoes or anything. This might be a tap out control deck. Oh, there's Treacherous Blessing. I I knew it. There's a Doom Foretold in this deck. This is uh, Esper Doom. Yep, there's the Doom Foretold. Okay, well, hopefully we get there. Man, I think I'm just gonna. I think I'm gonna Castle Vantress. Oh, glad I did. Jeez, so many lands in a row. <laughs> Look at all those lands. <laughs> all right, that's cool. Uh, we'll get rid of the Overwhelming Apprentice. Well, there's a Thassa's Oracle. Uh, let's start with the Oracle. No, let's start with the Behemoth. Beomoth. We'll get the Oracle. I mean, it doesn't matter, because I can't draw anyway. Um, Agent. <laughs> it doesn't matter. That's a good game. We'll just we'll just tell him good game. We'll we'll end it. Uh, man, how to how to just blow through eight thousand games in thirty minutes? Play jank. Okay, well I'm not as excited about this deck anymore. It worked really well against me. I think I was playing. Um, I guess I even remember what I was playing. Playing something that was a little bit too slow. They hit it on uh, turn five. They just hit the combo turn five. Well, this isn't it. All right, we're gonna keep it. Uh, I don't really have a good shuffler, do I? Like, if I wanted to shuffle one of these back in, I don't have anything that's gonna do that. So I'll just hold on to it this way. Yeah, this combo is just so... Uh, glass cannony. It's uh, It's got a lot of ways to disrupt it. It's okay, though. It's alright. We'll just uh, Thassa's Oracle. Try to get another land. Is he going to counter this? I was like, what? Uh, he's just... Uh, he's on uh, four colors, so... I'm guessing this is um, uh, Fires of niv or whatever, Rainbow Fires, whatever you want to call it. Um, Alright, well that's not a land. But at least it's, you know, one card to the bottom. <clears throat> Gives us the possibility of drawing a land. But uh, yeah, I'm guessing it's like a Fires deck. Oh, Thought Erasure. That's not to Buenos. It's gonna take Kiora. Or the Lotus. Either one is really bad for me. Like this combo falls apart without either of those. Um so I need to I need to get an untapper. I need to get like there's so many moving parts here. Well, I'm gonna keep him like this. If he doesn't tear my hand apart further, I can uh um, I can get a Nyx Lotus down next turn. I'm not assuming there's a lot of counter spells here, but you know, again, I think it's like a five color, uh, like Rainbow Niv Mizzet deck or whatever. Oh, neat! Tamio pull back the Thought Erasure. Nope, Tamio digging. Is that four lands? I was asking the trophy in three lands. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's try to just take down Tamio a little bit here. The fact that there's Deafening Clarion in the deck, again, it points really heavily to, uh, to a Fires of Invention deck. I will not be surprised if I see fires come out. 
I think this is actually the deck that I was running. Not the same list, but the same archetype. I think I was on like turn four, turn five, uh, and they were on their turn five. Um, yeah, there's the Niv-Mizzet. All right, let's see. It's one, two, three, seven. All right, so I have like seven. I think, I think I'm gonna go this way and look for an untapper as a corridor monitor. All right. You can get anything back you want, but you're gonna lose your Tamiyo if you do it. <sighs> Come on, fingers crossed. Let's get there. Let's get there. Come on. Don't wipe my board. Just do whatever you want. Don't wipe my board. <laughs> oh, is this going to be a casualty? No, he doesn't have black. Uh, come on. Come on. Don't win my board. Alright, what are we bringing back? Okay, there's the black source. There's the... Ah, that's gonna suck. It's gonna be casualties of war. Uh, there goes my next Lotus. The turn before I got to the finale. Like, I have it. It's just one turn too late. Oh, so frustrating. So frustrating. <laughs> just trying to get this deck to work is just... Oh, it's a nightmare. It's just a nightmare. I can't even... Okay, so if I can draw a, a Nyx... Um, a Nyx Lotus off the top, I can't even cast it. Oh, man. All right. Well, I don't know how much more I want to sit around for this. He's gonna, he's gonna get, yeah. It's all of the stuff. Oh. Okay. Well. <sighs> oh, I just realized this doesn't even take up the whole box. <laughs> eh, oh well. All right. Well, let's mill him a little bit. Uh, yeah, that's that's not gonna work. All right, well, I think that's game. He's gonna he's got another casualties. Yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna sit through this. He's got another casualties. He can get two of the things. He can despark the other thing. Like it's just uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's that's just not gonna work. All right, we're gonna try it again. Oracle combo, janky 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 times. All right. Tink, 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 Is my opponent at 83? Is, did I read that right? Yeah, 83. Wow, I didn't know I could go that low. Oh, stuff. That's something to look forward to. <laughs> All right, well, we're going gonna to try to jam it. What are you on, opponent? Alright, something green. My guess is uh, a Simic Ramp. Ooh, something with, with gates. I see, maybe you are also a practitioner of jank. Cross Barrel? Nope. Okay, okay. I see this Kiora mirror. Well. All right. What am I at? Four, five, six, seven. Do something wild. 
Ooh. Don't kill my Kyura. He's gonna kill my Kyura. <laughs> okay. Well, that doesn't that that doesn't that's not good for the next Lotus. Uh, Cavalier of Chaos. It's only three mana. All right. So, or six mana if I you know double tap it. So that puts me at eleven. I'm like one shy. <clears throat> of course, my opponent. <sighs> so frustrating. All right, can I get Cavalier of Gales? I lose. I'm gonna lose one, right? It's one, two, three, eight. I need nine. Yeah, I, I don't have enough for for both. So I'm gonna Cavalier of Gales and then hope for the best. My opponent's on just some kind of weird Planeswalker deck. Might get a four four. I'm guessing. Oh no. Okay. Protecting the Jace or the Teferi. I just call him Jace. I don't know. It's a weird thing I do. Yeah, because that would be four. Like an untapped to make it three, and then it's only four back. All right, so we're going to go ahead and Cavalier of Gales. Um, put these two back. No, we'll put these two back. Yeah. Let's mill the opponent, find out what they're doing. I have no fucking clue what they're doing. <laughs> Let's be honest. I, I really don't know, but corridor monitor off the top is really nice. Okay. No attacks. Uh, yeah. Why did I right click? I wanted to left click there. Okay. So we've got. Narset would be. Re that would have been like game over. All right. What are they going to bounce? I'm guessing this is a bounce. Bounce the cav, okay. Exile intervention. Maybe I should have bounced. Uh, maybe I should have exiled the cavalier. Uh, I don't know. I'm wondering if the better play for them. Ah, uh, this is I don't know. Like, I want to say that the better play would have been to do the dumber play. My opponent's too smart. Um, but if they would have knocked off the flying here and made it a three-five. Oh man. Yeah, their board just eliminated my board. Like, there's just too many things the planeswalkers are doing over there. Ugh, so frustrating. Yeah, I don't I don't see a path to victory here either. I'm just gonna concede this one. They just they're 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 just too disruptive, even with this crazy jank. <laughs> even with this crazy jank, they were just too disruptive. Oh, that's just terrible. Oh man. Alright, let's see. In alcohol. Nope, oh, I don't think this is a, a productive hand, but we're gonna keep it. We're gonna hope for the best. This is just more of whatever's happening there. All right, well, this is extra bad, but, you know, we got an overwhelmed apprentice. Uh, instead of drawing a land, we got another over overwhelmed apprentice, and then <laughs> two more not lands. All right, cool. Wow. Glad we had the scry on that one. All right, well, there's a shock that's not hitting our face, so that's good, I guess. Probably going to have to throw down... I'm going to throw down the oracle here. Um... 
but we're probably also going to have to throw it on a, a monitor ahead of schedule. Um, we'll get the island. So we've looked at like, I don't know, eight cards now, whatever that's been. Uh, one, two, three. I don't think it's eight. I think it's like four cards. Um, wow. All right, well, the Annex is bad. Cavalier of Gales would be really good, so we're going to hold on to this. No attacks. We're going to be on the defensive. That Annex is going to rip through us pretty, pretty, pretty hard. Ooh, Legion War Boss. Okay, that's cute. Um, I think I'm just going to pick it up here. Yeah, we'll just take the five from the Annex. Oh, there's a lot, a lot that, that we're looking forward to here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and mill my opponent. We're going to get uh, Cavalier. This is just not looking good. <laughs> there's, I don't I don't see a lot of upside for this deck. I guess my, my final grade for this is... Uh, fail. I failed to play it or I failed to build it properly. Uh, the one victory that we got today was uh, just somebody quitting early. And I don't think we have uh, a chance in this game. Alright, upside they're throwing all of their creatures into it. So that's cool. So we'll just block here and here. Oop, here and here. Um, but we're still not in a, a great way. Alright, let's just put both of these back. Doesn't really matter how they get ordered. No attacks. So we shrank Annex, but Embercleave's going to make that a, a joke. Uh, I guess Embercleave's not coming. Uh, Alright. I still, I don't have like a draw spell though, that's the... Uh, the constant problem. Uh, maybe I just didn't put enough draw spells in here. So we can do this and this. And then we can go this route. And that untaps this. And then we can do this. But we are in trouble. Next. No attacks. In turn. Because even our next... Uh, our next card's just a land, so we need to kill Cavalier of Gale, Gale somehow. And keep uh, Kiora alive. I shouldn't have dropped that Kiora. I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter, because I'm going to lose, but <laughs> I don't know. My opponent's going really hard at the Planeswalkers, and they could have killed me by now. <clears throat> So that's what, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's one, two, three, four, five. But I'm gonna lose so much mana off of the, the Nyx Lotus that it's, I don't even know that this is worth it. And if it's an Ember Cleave, then it just doesn't matter. But they could have absolutely just killed me here. Especially if they wouldn't have worried about the Jace. Plenty of damage coming through. Come on, opponent. Oh, gosh. 
So yeah, they're gonna get it. So honestly, I don't, I don't know. Uh, again, my my overall for this deck just not worthwhile. Not in this meta. Not in best of one anyway. It's a uh, the stuff's way too fast for it. But it was cute getting beat by it. So anyway, uh, that's all. Good game. Have fun.